This is an ABC Action News Tracking the Tropics update. Sponsored by these valued partners. All right, as we're taking a look at the tropics, all eyes are on this red hashed mark area here that you're seeing. And of course, for good reason, we're watching a tropical wave that's going to be moving north. And as it progresses, we're going to get a better and better idea of how it could impact our area. And at this point in time, it does look like the models are indicating that we are going to, at a minimum, get some beneficial rains across uh, parts of the Gulf Coast of Florida and then extending on through North Florida as it then exits off into the Atlantic uh, through our southeastern states in uh, th the middle of next week. So again, any impacts are going to be uh, noticed across the state of Florida into early next week, but we'll be watching for development between now and into Monday and Tuesday. So again, we'll be watching for that development. At this point in time, the models are suggesting that rain chances will start to increase. We'll start to see rain totals accumulating uh, late Tuesday or into Wednesday and then coming to an end uh, more than likely by Thursday, possibly into Friday in the most extreme case if it slows down. But again, we're looking at mainly beneficial rains. I don't want you to pay too much attention to the numbers. These numbers are going to change dramatically, uh, more than likely up and down, and they're going to shift position over the next couple of days as uh, the system starts to develop and we see where the center of the system is. It will give us a much better idea as to where the higher rainfall totals will be. So again, what we know is that we're more than likely going to see some increased rain chances here across the state of Florida uh, coming into the middle of next week. And again, we'll be monitoring this very closely. As far as the rest of the tropics go, although we're monitoring other systems, there are uh, no systems out here that we are concerned about having any impacts on our weather.